I do want to play a little bit more Senator Kenny Kennedy. Uh, this was another just, I mean, disconnect from reality that we heard about what happened at the debate and what President Trump did. Let's listen. And how, how quickly did it, did it come to you that you were having that bad night? Well, Kane and I was having a bad night when I realized that even when I was answering a question, even when I turned his mic off, he was still shouting. And I, I let it distract me. I, I'm not blaming on that. But I realized that I just wasn't in control. I watched the whole debate. I never saw President Trump shouting in a microphone that wouldn't let him shout. I mean, you, we would hear his shouting in Biden's microphone. That just didn't happen. Well, look, actually, as we all know, the microphones were cut off when it wasn't the speaker's turn. And, and I don't really understand what President Biden was referring to. Um, hmm. I, I do think that the White House is doing their president, our president, a disservice tonight. The, the White House says that, well, uh, all, they're like Kevin Bacon at the end of Animal House. All is well. Don't panic. Uh, we've been transparent the entire time. Uh, this White House, they would know transparency if it jumped up and yodeled and bit them in the butt. There has been a cover up and many members of the media have participated in it. And now some members of the media, they, 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 they're running around going, we're dumbfounded. We never saw any sign of this. Um, I mean, and they're asking, is the president, uh, can he stand for re-election? His own Justice Department a few months ago said that he's not even competent to stand trial. Um, what parachute did these, yeah. or what, what planet did these people parachute in from? The American people may be poorer under President Biden, but they're not stupid. And their, their concerns and suspicions have been confirmed.